over the 5.20. Set now. Lily Milo, just my size. Marilina Franco began well and will share the lead with Lily Milo. Getting across then was Clover Cottage. Spooky Assassin further back. Just my size. A fair way back. Don't knock a Tom and Megan Fury. Marilina Franco leading down the back. Lily Milo won't go away. Followed by Spooky Assassin. Just my size. Around them quickly then. Don't knock a Tom. Megan Fury. And forget Clover Cottage. Any petrol left in the tank. Marilina Franco. First look at the journey. Is going strongly. Coming again. Lily Milo. Spooky Assassin. Late and don't knock a Tom. Oh gee, Marilina Franco maybe, but there's nothing in it. Don't knock a Tom, Spooky Assassin, Megan's Fury, Lily Milo well back there with just my size and Clover Cottage. This is very tight. Spooky Assassin, the one on the outside, I think is the one to worry about. It's very wide on the track, so it's a three-way photo there between 4, 5 and 6, around the 30 and 10 mark. 4.43 and 15.10, the early splits. And the run home, it's got on the outside. Spooky Assassin in the last stride has collared, I would suggest, Marilina Franco and don't knock a Tom. Six, five and four there. Spooky Assassin, wide on the track, Shane Robinson, training for the Spooky Eight Syndicate. Fawn Dog by Radley Bale at a Saturn Assassin, prepared by Shane Lakely. 443, 15, 10. And 15.06, it was a half head each way, a half head each way, 6.549 on race 7 from Lismore. Thank you. 